Hi, I'm Mrs. Gaither, and the book I'm going to share with you tonight is The Mysterious Benedict Society by Trenton Lee Stewart. The main character of this story is Remy Muldoon, and you find out in the first couple pages that he's actually an orphan. And one day when he's sitting with his favorite teacher and tutor, they discover an ad in the newspaper requesting intelligent children to come and take a series of examinations. They decide that since he hasn't been challenged in school for a while, that maybe this is something that he'd actually enjoy doing. So he goes to the first exam and he makes the cut. He gets to go another test and another test, and in the end, he finds out that only four children make the cut in the end. He's joined by another boy named George Washington, who goes by the nickname Sticky, a girl named Kate that has this bucket that's tied to her waist all the time to it with her belt that's full of all kinds of items and just all kinds of interesting tools, and then they're joined by another girl named Constance. The four of them come together at the home of Mr. Benedict, and his home is actually a huge maze in itself, and while they're there, they form the basis of what becomes the Mysterious Benedict Society. He has actually chosen them to go on a special mission. He wants to send them to this island school that's called the Learning Institute for the Very Enlightened. There's this event that's getting ready to take place. And Mr. Benedict does not believe that it's going to be good for the local citizens and maybe the entire world. But he doesn't know exactly what it is. So he sends the children to this school undercover. And while they're there, they don't know what they're looking for. They don't know if they're looking for a person or what. But what they do is they observe, they watch, they listen. And while they're there, they have to accomplish a series of tasks where they all four must work together as a team in order to be successful. What's really interesting is you're just going to fall in love with each one of these characters. And in the end, when they do solve the mystery of what's getting ready to happen, it's okay because there's already a sequel out. Come into the West Middle Library, check out this book. It's a huge adventure. You're going to love it. The Mysterious Benedict Society by Trenton Lee Stewart. I thought it was a great story, and I know that you will too.